What's up, Casa? Welcome back to school. It looks like we somehow managed to make it through 2020 and finals. Not sure which is worse, but here we are. My name is Lizzie, and I'm and I'm one of your anchors for today's broadcast. And I'm Michael, your other news anchor for today's broadcast. Today we're going to be going over when the French club meeting takes place, scholarship opportunities, the smoke screenings, and more. First up though, we're going to check out a short PSA made by none other than our very own news anchor, Lizzie. Hey you! Who? Me? No. The girl next to you. Yes, you! Uh, hi? Are you sick of getting peanut butter all over your hands for no specific reason? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Then you should try our latest product, soap and water. Whoa, what's that? It's literally just soap and water, you idiot. I'm telling you to wash your hands. Oh. Like, seriously, it's been weeks, dude. Not cool. Well, yeah, but just wash your hands. Are you happy now? Are you happy? Washing your hands is especially important now that we have COVID spreading very rapidly. So to keep us safe from germs and viruses such as COVID, we have to wash our hands to keep you and others safe and make sure to do it for 20 seconds. So don't be an idiot like this guy here. No, oh, come on! Now, what did we learn today? To wash your hands. Good. Now stay safe, everyone. Bye. Wash your hands. <laughs> Yeah, it might be a good idea to wash your hands. We might not know everything there is to know about COVID, but we do know that washing your hands and wearing a mask over your face and nose helps prevent the spread of it. First up is the French meeting details on Wednesday, January 13th at 1 p.m. They're going to be discussing what they did over break as well as learn about different cultures and, of course, French. We also have a lot of information about the Crystal Rodriguez Scholarship Foundation. Crystal Rodriguez was a 2007 graduate of Castle Robo who passed away far too early at the age of 22. She loved life and was very involved on campus via soccer and student government. This scholarship is our way of honoring her spirit. You can look on the counseling webpage for the application. You must have a minimum GPA of 3.0 as well as some proof of financial hardship. Things such as letters of recommendation and community activities are also considered and finalists will be interviewed. Let's watch a video made by Ty Rector about driving safely. Uh -huh. On top of the Crystal Rodriguez Scholarship Foundation, the largest bilingual and binational university fair in Northern California will be held virtually every, every Saturday throughout February 2021. There will be representatives from distinguished colleges and universities of both California and Mexico. On top of that, there's going to be a higher education experts from the state of California and nonprofit higher education organizations working together in order to provide help for students to get into college and learn about their financial options in order to get a higher education. Let's check out a short video by your other news anchor, Michael Charisman.
Lastly, we'd like to discuss the smoke screenings presented by Breathe California, Sacramento region. Usually we would have a gathering in the school cafeteria where we get together, watch the movies to learn how normalized tobacco is in today's media. We would also have food and play some games, but this year we have to do things virtually. On Thursday, January 21st from 3 to 4 p.m., students who are interested should email Ms. Otero at cyotero.sanjuanedu. Let's check out one last video made by Kyle Miller before we head out for this week. That's it for today, CASA. Be sure to stay tuned for future broadcasts. Bye, CASA. Bye, CASA.